Hello and welcome to the cryptocurrency news channel. We got an emergency alert on Ethereum because merge is nearing and you must sell ETH by this price. And I'm going to tell you why. At least you need to sell ETH uh, at 2200 or slightly below. And if you actually, this is based on derivatives data. What it's actually showing is that there's more call options before 2200, but more put options after 2200. A lot of put options after 2200 after the merge happens. So basically, you know that there's going to be a big sell off after merge based on the derivatives data. People are looking for insurance and security after the merge. And that magic price is 2200. Now, there are call options all the way up to 5,000, but being realistic, 5,000 is just not going to happen. And the magical point where like uh, puts start beating calls is around $2,200. Now, what I would do is sell at least around $2,100 just to be on the safe side or even $2,000. Because the thing is, if you bought into Ethereum early, like when I did the last video, uh, when I did the first video about the merge, you're probably already up like, you know, 200% or 100% at least because Ethereum came up from like $800. And it's not really worth risking uh, it all for 10% because there is going to be a dump post merge. The uh, derivatives data definitely show that. And that magical turning point is $2,200. Now to even get to $2,200, I do think it would require a Bitcoin to turn bullish, which is extremely possible at this particular time, because you know, we're still at 23,800, could easily go to like 24,800 and Bitcoin, uh, Ethereum could reach 21, 2200. So what I would do is I would definitely put my sell order starting at 2000, all the way up to 2200 and you have to sell before the 15th. Now I know the official date of the merge is around the 19th, but the way the block works, I think it's actually gonna be slightly ahead of schedule. So you want to put it there on the 15th. The other, there's one more big, big reason that you actually need to sell um, before the 15th and at least around 2000 to 2200. And that is because there was a big transfer to an exchange of 145,000 Ethereum. Now, some of that's probably gonna be used for staking, but some of it's probably going to be dumped. I'm, but it is an Ethereum whale wallet. But I do think some of that is gonna be dumped. And even though the analysts say it's not enough volume to actually affect Ethereum price. You have to remember a lot of the volume on crypto exchanges is watch trading volume. So such a big dump of straight selling would actually affect the price in my opinion. Obviously, I could definitely be wrong about that, but in my opinion, it would actually affect the price. So the thing is, yes, ETH, um, actually uh, Ethereum does actually need to be dumped before the 15th and Ethereum does need to be dumped at around 2,000 to 2,200. The lower you go, the more secure you are. I do believe Ethereum will pump above 2,000 at some time or other. I don't think it's gonna get much above 2,200 if it hits 2,200, but those call and put options are signaling you to actually sell uh, somewhere between 2,000 and 2,200, and that is the critical point. So that's the news for today. Let me know what you think, like and subscribe. Hit that bell notifications button. Thank you and have a nice day.